Well, good day, Screwball here. I am uh, going to upload probably three or four videos till I get caught up on uploading videos today. Um, so, just, we haven't had good service in, uh, in quite a while as we go through New Hampshire. And I'm at a uh, Trail Angels house right now. It's got good service, so I'm going to go ahead and upload, get caught up, hopefully get caught up for today. And then um, we're going to come back in the next two days and then I'll upload videos and get caught up on that. But once I leave here, I have about 200 miles left. I do not know how well I'll be able to upload videos because they, um, the service is just ridiculous. And also that's one reason I haven't answered or anything on all the uh, comments. I do appreciate y'all commenting. But um, let me get these uploaded and then I'll go back and I'll go over the, the comments and stuff. But I appreciate y'all sticking with me and um, we'll see y'all on up the trail. Well, good morning, Screwball here. It is Saturday, August 8th, day 141 of this Appalachian Trail journey. Um, we're fixing to start climbing presidentials. Um, so I'm gonna turn this camera around, let you see what we're starting at today and give you a view of what we're gonna be doing. We're gonna try to do uh, just a little over six miles and uh, set us up for uh, the presidentials tomorrow, the ridge walks over in Washington. And um, so when, if weather permitting, we can do that all in one day. So that's the plans. So as we go up this uh, mountain, I will uh, let you see some more things. Let me turn this around so you can see the mountains we're about to go up and uh, we're gonna get this day started. All right, we're gonna go across this footbridge where we ended up. We camped over in the woods last night. Uh, gonna go across the footbridge and then we're gonna head up that mountain. Uh, once we get up on it, there in about six miles, there's a campsite and a hut we're gonna set up on. And then uh, that'll give us all day tomorrow to uh, traverse the ridges, the presidentials. And then um, Monday we'll be uh, doing a new row and going in and resupplying and getting set for the rest of the journey. So y'all have a great day. I know we're going to, and we'll see you up the trail. Well, good morning. Screwball back here. Uh, just getting, hadn't been on trail 10, 15 minutes, but I thought I'd show you. Some of the rocks as we climb this mountain, we're still in the big open hardwood. I don't know if you can see that low under that rock, but uh, still in the open, what I call hardwood. I don't know if they're actually hardwood, but uh, timber, we're not in the spruce pine thickets yet. A lot of rocks here. So, uh, I'd show it to you for some reason everybody thinks I like rocks or something but uh what we're looking at today this morning so far uh we're gonna climb today and like I said be right under the tree line whenever we pull up to camp at the uh, campground so this is what we got a little bit of trail time this morning. When we woke up this morning, the birds were singing really good about five o'clock, but uh, they have since quietened down. So this is what we're doing and I'll show you further up trail. All right, this is our first view. That's Crawford Notch there. You see the road and the train tracks and the edges there. The train tracks are the high one, the road the lower one. We uh we came down right there last night. Come came across the road. We came down that valley. Yes, they worked their way down from the tops of that mountain right there. Worked our way down yesterday. And spent the night down there uh, 
right in there is where we spent the night at last night. So that's where we started our climb at this morning. You can see the rest of the mountains in the background. A view of these rocks that we're standing on. We will be going up and over that this morning and uh, making our way over that. So that's what we're doing today. There's our first views. So let us move on and uh, something else come up and I'll let you know. All right, we've uh, come across a couple of little the smaller mountains. We're still headed to Mizvah Hut, a human campsite. Uh, so, thought I'd give you a little bit of trail time. We've been high up in the top, uh, some pretty good views, but we're in the, still in the tree line. But that's where we're at, what we're looking at, so. Y'all have a great day. I'll show you some more when we get on up here. If he comes to my food, he's getting it. Oh my god. <laughs> there he goes, Canadian Jay. Not shy whatsoever. What? what? Thank you guys so much. That was so cool. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're on Mount Jackson. Uh, it's moistening over in the clouds. You see the hut right there. That's where we're stopping at today. Campsites. So, getting a bit of people up here. There's your Canadian Jay back. I don't think I have anything I could feed him, but we'll see. He's looking. All right, got a Canadian Jay. You just saw one eat out of my hand. Here comes another one. Let's see if we can get him to eat what's left in there. You don't know he's YouTube famous. See if we get him to come back for the last few crumbs. No, he went to the ground and got a bigger crumb. <laughs> All right, we got to move on. Uh, like I said, we're headed over to that hut, and then we're going to follow that ridge up, and that's Mount Washington in the clouds there. So we're going to move on north. We are uh, coming up on a bog. This bog is like, I don't, don't know how many thousand feet above everything else. But you got a little mountain over there. I know the mountain over there we just came off of. Oh, yeah. So uh, this is the bog. See him stick, his, stick it back down in there. I tried getting to step off in it for you, but he didn't do it. But this is a bog, and we're not even in Ireland. You're assistant, not your guinea pig. Yeah. <laughs> All right, but we're still headed north. As Washington over there, still got the cloud on it. Today would be a pretty day to be doing that, but we're going to have to wait till tomorrow. I hope the weather's just as good. So we're going to move on. When we get closer, I'll give you another shot. All right, now this might be one of the oldest footprints known to man. I mean, did not even wait to the lava to cool down before they put their foot in it. 
Looks like a size 14, maybe. Yeah, i tell you what. That's a big foot. That was a good size foot. So see, man was here a long, long time ago. Let's move on.